Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to install Photoshop styles and use them in your own work. Let's get started. The first step is to download some Photoshop styles. If you don't have any already, feel free to grab the project files now for some free styles to help you get going. Now typically, Photoshop styles are packed into a zip file along with other files like product and usage information. The actual style file itself is going to have a .asl file extension. You'll want to extract the contents of the zip file into a folder on your computer. I'll just extract mine to the desktop so they're easy to find. Now, there are three main ways to load styles in Photoshop. The first and most simple way is to drag and drop the ASL file into the Photoshop window. Now if you look in the Styles palette, you'll see that they've been loaded in. Another way is to click Edit, Presets, Preset Manager, and make sure that you have styles selected under the Preset Type drop-down. Then all you have to do is click Load, navigate to your styles, and double-click them to load them in. I'm not going to double click because I've already loaded them in using the first method. The third way is to click the drop down menu icon in the styles palette. Then you can just click load styles and double click on the styles that you want to load in again. Now that the styles are loaded in, we'll go into our document and see how to use them. Styles can be applied to almost any layer, but are mostly used for things like text. With your layer selected, simply click the thumbnail for the style that you want to apply and it will instantly be applied to your layer. That's really all there is to it. I also want to share with you a few tips that I've learned along the way. If you download a style and it doesn't quite look like the preview images, you can try using a different font. But keep in mind that most styles look best using a pretty thick font. If it still doesn't look right, you can right click the list of effects in the layers palette and choose scale effects. That way, you can scale just the layer styles while keeping the rest of the image the same. This makes it easier to adjust the styles to match your own documents. Keep in mind that Photoshop styles can be used on more than just text, like shapes and even fill layers too. I'm John Shaver for Photoshop Video Academy. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.